We began the investigation in 1980 because we realized the, the limitations of the Lakewood Civic Auditorium and because we were trying to reach as many school students as we could with Shakespeare. So Mary Bill and I decided one day to just come down to the Ohio Theater and look at it. And we did. And we both loved it. We were both wise enough, I guess, to see with all the grime and destruction that the bones of this place were really beautiful. And we became the first residents of Playhouse Square. And it was lonely. We were the only ones down here, and we had to quickly have the theater renovated because we had to move in by June of 1982. My father was a contractor, and he came into the theaters in January and looked at them and said, honey, you're never going to make it. <laughs> I said, we're going to make it, and we did. The first show we did was As You Like It. I remember being amazed that we had made it. <laughs> I remember thinking that night that we were so fortunate that all the elements had come together and allowed us to find this wonderful new home and for us to be the landmark, really, resident company that started Playhouse Square and its return. For most of us, it was a very emotional evening. And I know the Playhouse Square Board, John Lewis, Great Lakes Board, and I hope a lot of Clevelanders who love theater were very thrilled.